Yeah, 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 yeah. How y'all doing this morning? Just came back from downtown, man. I dropped some people off downtown. Got my White Castle breakfast. Stock market just opened. My alerts went off. Let me know that the market opened up in a down market in a decline. In the video all the way down to 125, I put another thousand dollars on now. Some of you guys are in my comment section. You guys are asking, you say, hey, Andrew, I don't understand. You got money for crypto. You got money for stocks, but you don't got money to get the windshield fits, get the brakes fits, pay car insurance, you know, or put gas in the car, things like that. And I understand what you truck drivers are saying. Totally understand. Oh, I ain't really got no statement to tell you, but uh, one of y'all said y'all wanted to donate to give me a new windshield. You was asking for my cash out. Driver, definitely appreciate you for wanting to donate to the to the good Andrew. I'd rather you keep your money. I'm pretty sure you got some credit card debt that you need to pay back. Maybe a car loan, student loan, maybe a mortgage. I'd rather you just put that money on that right there. Got to go a, a longer way than trying to get me a windshield. Andrew ain't caring nothing about this windshield, baby. I can still see out of it. Everything going to be all right. Matter of fact, DOT would say, pretend my windshield is legal. Because there ain't no cracks in it. There is no cracks in it. That's the size of a quarter. Okay. Looks pretty legal to me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. As far as my braids, I actually do have brand new braids all the way around. It's just the rotors need to be replaced. So the car actually stops because I got brand new brakes. It's just it vibrates because the rotors need to be replaced or resurfaced. So that's all. But like I said, I appreciate everybody for wanting to donate. This ain't the donation channel. You have to go over to the lease drivers channel where they need donations every day. I don't need your donations, man. I got, I'm doing, I'm doing, I'm not doing good, but I'm surviving day by day, okay? The stock market take a, take all my paychecks, so I'm, you know, I really probably do, probably could apply for food stamps because I really ain't having no money. I mean, I got the hobo special on every day, can't get my hair cut, call jacked up, shoot, ain't got no car insurance, y'all, y'all said dealership. When you, when you ain't got no car insurance, the dealership come come snatch your car. So, I don't see no dealerships behind me. So, I don't see no repo truck come yet. So, I guess that must mean I own the car. I'm not sure. I don't see no dealerships coming. So, I don't know how that work out. But, man, what else? So, we got 130 shares in the video. Then we got some other shares and other different stocks that, you know, you can see that on the community post. Although I'm not going to show you the amount of shares I got in other stuff. But, you know, you can see what I buy whenever I buy it. Moving along, man. Trucking. What's going on in trucking? Today is Tuesday. Today is Tuesday, man. It's back to work. Back to work. We got to get back to work. We got to get back to this money. Matter of fact, today is the last day before pay cut off. Uh, my paycheck this week is not going to be uh, $2,000. It's not going to be $2,000 because last week I didn't feel like working. So I barely worked last week. So it's probably going to be like maybe sixteen, seventeen hundred, 1700 and then take home thirteen, fourteen, twelve hundred. 1400 I don't know, something. Nah, I ain't going to be that low. Probably like thirteen, fourteen, take home, something like that. Like I said, I don't feel like working. I probably ain't going to feel like working a day either. But tomorrow, I may get some motivation and start grinding again. I don't know, but they about to start school up in August. All these people about to get back to reality. I need to be in somebody's school in August, too, to be honest with you. Because I don't want to do this trucking thing forever. Not with this type of money I'm making right now. And this type of no freedom. You know, this, my life is boring right now. All it consists of is... 
waking up, going to Mr. Charlie's job, and sleeping with women and stuff like that all day. It gets boring, man. It gets very boring. I'd rather try and get back to going out of town and trips and being able to blow $10,000 in a day and get it back tomorrow. I'm trying to be like that again. Shit, I'm just saying. I need to get one of these trusts together. Do y'all think Trump going to get in office? I'm just wondering because told y'all for me to get back in my fleet. A couple of things on the wheel got to realign, and, and Trump being in office is one of them. Not, I'm not. I'm not vote. I'm not a voter for all y'all people as Democrats. I am not a voter. Okay, I don't vote. I'm not registered to vote. My opinion does not matter. Truck driver. I'm just saying. Now the fact, if Vince McMahon was running for the Democrats, and it was Vince McMahon versus Donald Trump. I would vote for Vince McMahon, for the Democrats, okay? But Vince McMahon ain't running. So, what? Anyways, man, I ain't got nothing to talk to y'all about. I'm just making noise, making noise early in the morning. Yeah, I just came on here to let y'all know we put another thousand dollars in the video. We we lost some more money. We losing so much money that RS owed me a refund. You know, they owe me a refund. Lost a lot of money this year. Ain't having no money, nothing. So uh, one of y'all said, "Hey Andrew, man, you no know, stock market is like gambling. The house always wins." I told that fella, I said, "Hey man, no." Uh, May want to look in to getting your GED, man. Uh, you know, uh, it's hard to win without it out here. May want to go back to school, you know, start learning again, man. Get the education up. Stock market ain't for you, man. You don't have the education to be uh, in that type of world. To be to, that, that ain't for you. It ain't for a lot of people. It ain't. For, there's a lot of truck drivers can't save no money. It's not for them. Stock market is for people. Who got a bunch of extra cash sitting around like Andrew here? Okay, I me I, I'm good at saving. I got a bunch of cash just sitting in, and sitting ahead a bunch of cash sitting in the bank account. I don't do that no more. I don't sit no money in the bank no more. So when you like somebody like me who just got all thousands of dollars sitting in the bank and the bank going to pay you freaking damn Andrew, man, you really helping us out, man. We didn't fund it. We done bought a couple of homes, and we done bought, you know, we done let a bunch of people borrow all this money off your money, and here you go, Andrew, here's your, here's your, your seven cent for the year. Appreciate you sitting all that money in the account like that. Yeah, I ain't doing that no more. I ain't doing that no more. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Now when I go to the bank, I don't go to the bank, though, but if I was to go to the bank, When I get up to the counter, they see how much money in my account. Zero balance. Shit. I ain't eligible for nothing. How far y'all think the stock market going to dip? Because let me tell you something about stocks. No matter what price you buy in at, it's just going to keep going down. I got in at 125, it's probably going to go to 120, 115, 119, maybe down to 100, okay? I don't care where it go. All I know is the lower way it go, I keep buying. I don't listen to truck drivers. I'm the 1%. I got to do everything completely opposite from 99% of the truck drivers. That way I get different results. I don't want the same results as y'all. I'm the 1%. I got to do everything opposite. Y'all want these trucks? I need cash trucks. I don't like paying a bunch of payments nonstop over and over and over and over, year after year after year. Like the Joshua thing. Y'all got a lot to say in the comment section. Y'all didn't realize that video was three years ago? We shot that video in 2021. That was me and Josh. When he had Black Pearl, I had the $15,000 flat top coming off a fresh rebuild. He thought he was winning. With all that goddamn debt and truck payments and all that, 
I only had one truck at the time, no trailer, no nothing. And uh, look at how it turned out. Okay, I ended up buying two trucks, a trailer, starting the authority, making a gobble money, still having more money than him to this day. And him, he ain't got a trash signal to show for all this goddamn going from one side of the planet to the other he done done. And I got on top of that, I got an insurance and just his license in between all that. And if he just go a little bit longer on this leasing train, I'm going to have a house on top of him. So, let me get off here. I'm talking too much.